control. This game will learn to control yourself. And if you fail to control yourself, you'll be in big trouble. Think of this as a personal test. To see if you can be your personal best. And the game is called The Control. Can't wait for the sequel, Space Bar. Why, why am I Hispanic, Strong Bad? The, the very, like, first version of Strong Bad sort of had, like, an accent to it. I think because he's, like, a, he's, he was supposed to kind of be, like, a luchador type character, and then... It kind of evolved into I'm strong bad. I know that you mention it. But anyway, this is control. Yeah, here we go. Let's hope the game works. This looks like it could be like a tool album insert art or something. Like, have you ever seen Tool album art before? The band Tool, this is a very up their alley background right here. From the makers of Sleepy Allen. Oh my goodness, there's all kinds of options here. Um. Film grain on. I'm just gonna leave everything how they are, I think. Oh yeah, speaker's name in the subtitle is very important. There's so many options, it's like I'm playing a PC game. Yeah, it looked like the subtitles were on. Let me check. Oh, they weren't on. The settings for subtitles were set, but the, the, the subtitles themselves weren't on. All right, let's do this. Uh-oh. What is it with like so many games, like, it started with like, I, like survival horror stuff, because I guess you're in a lot of dark rooms. But it's, so many games where you have to like adjust the brightness. The middle icon. Barely visible. Um, left icon not visible. Wait, is this a joke? Because there is no left icon. Unless that's... Oh, if there's a left icon, it's not showing up on my monitor at all. Uh, okay. But by the time you've made this so bright that the left icon could even potentially be visible, then clearly this icon's way too bright too. Kind of weird. I'll just have it like, I don't know. Like... Uh, all right, here we go. New borough employees often get lost in the shifting corridors of the oldest house. When in doubt, look for green direction signs and consult the D-pad up map. Oldest house. The oldest house in the world. We finally found it after all these years. Fair warning. This is going to be what weirder was that? than usual. Can't be helped. I heard like a... You called me. So here I am. 
Wherever you go, there you are. Oh, you don't have to tell me not to use a map. I know I shut you out sometimes. I'm always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. The FBC? The room. And the poster. The picture's oh, something Disney. nice. A landscape, a famous person. Like in that movie, what is it called? The prison movie. The Shawshank Redemption? The room's a cell and the picture, it's different. For each of us, it can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. Something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. We all feel safe in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. I'm here. Why did you bring me here? Hello? Anyone here? Let me go, let me go, let me go, let me go. How violently we can vibrate. You guys have to be pretty impressed. Whoa, is that the lighting? The lighting has like some weird effects going on. It reminds me of the title screen, actually. Yeah, I see it. But what is it? I can feel it. It resonates. The things you show me, my friend, I forget. It's all in my head. There's no you, right? Ow. Where is everybody? I need someone to point me in the right direction. Ask that guy outside. I really like her running animation. It's so silly. I don't know what about it. I think it's because her, her her face is like... Her head is like motionless while she's running. I think that's what it is. Is it? In comparison to the body. <laughs> Prohibited items reminder. Current objects are not allowed inside the bureau. Recent incidents have necess necessitated an issue reminder on prohibited materials. Unauthorized weapons, pagers, lap pagers, who, who still uses pagers? Laptops, smart watches, smart phones, smart gaming devices, anything smart, number two pencils. Any object considered iconic representations of an archetypal concept. For example, rubber ducks and ketchup bottles. All material under bureau investigation is to be brought in through private entrances. If any lobby personnel in breach of these policies, please notify your superior immediately. Huh. Kind of a weird intro. It just like throws you right into. We don't know who she is. We don't know anything about her except. He, he seems a little paranoidy. He was like talking about, oh, this is just in my head, but wait, aren't you telling me what to do? He was like kind of 
waxing philosophical about all you see is your room and a poster and then I don't know if she was literally just talking about when you're in, in being imprisoned or she was saying living is a type of imprisonment. Did that door just open by itself? Expenditure summary. Mold removal, janitorial costs, HQ livability costs. Staffing surveillance data center. This seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. Can I watch the... What is it called? Night Town? Waterfall Village? Oh my gosh, this is the scariest yet. Oh, there he is. That was terrifying the way he was all loaded. Or bureau at work. Night Springs, that's the one I was thinking. Oh. Zachariah Trench. Zechariah is not a real name. I don't know why TV shows and games keep you in just a made up name. Make sure to keep those portraits in mind. Well, you have. Oh my god, he got even more unloaded than last time. So you have the director, judge. Zachariah, you have backwards janitor. <clears throat> and you have Dr. Bowtie. Dr. Casper Darling. Federal Bureau of Control. One of the leaves. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. to wash your hands. Your hands can spread the mold. Speak in moderate volume. No using photocopier for personal projects or the 3D printer or the bureau stationery. The one to finish the coffee pot makes a new one. Let's say hi and welcome to some of the new old, sorry, the new people in the oldest house. The new oldest people. That picture is is brighter than the other ones right there. The uh, and the these must be like devs because they look like actual pictures. <clears throat> Doctor Darling. Socks and ballerinas. That's the name of a band. <clears throat> Acoustic guitar for sale. So you can just put whatever you want on this board, huh? It's one of those, like, uh, those free spaces. Crouch. Maybe we'll learn how to crouch later. I don't think any of the buttons. Oh, never mind. That's not even open anyways, is it? <clears throat> it's just a really clean window is all. They had to scan Polaroids because they couldn't use digital cameras. Uh. Oh. You're not allowed to have digital cameras in here? What if it's not a smart camera? What the heck? Pistachios. Oh, this is like the most neutral looking, dystopian looking snacks I've ever seen. I 
don't know why you need to hold the button down. But if I'm hitting that button, I gotta I mean it. Attention all blank. Blank a shark in his blank, although secure blank. Permission to blank following basic protocol blank shoot to kill blank. Good luck. The shoot the kill part should have been covered up. Pretty important. Hello, as you all should know by now, the R4 reports are due by the end of the week. We're still waiting on them from a number of people. If you need an extension, please request your form R4.E from your supervisor. If you think you're exempt from filing an R4, then you'll need to get written permission from your department chief saying so. If you're exempt from getting permission, you need to get permission. Uh, remember, R4 is a mandatory under section 75.2 of the employee manual. Darfur requires interdepartmental claims, then please contact the appropriate department head, Dr. Darling, Ms. Marshall, Mr. Salvador, Mr. Kirkland, as needed. They'll be busy on Thursday in their annual policy review, so please schedule accordingly. All right, then. I'm so dark, I need a flashlight. I'm actually kind of draining my eyes. Hello? I just heard like backwards moaning. Oh, it's just the janitor. Look at this. What is this outlaw doing here? Jane Smith have a picture of an outlaw. Hey, excuse me. Hmm? Look at that wild there hair. You are. you are here about the job. Are you Irish? Janitor's assistant. Or Scottish. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti, the janitor, by the way. You work for me. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they tell you are no helmet. Oh, finish. There be okay. work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you mouth. Yeah, the more I heard the voice, the more I was I've heard. done enough night shift loner jobs to know it makes us come off weird. Ahti, the janitor, is a friendly face in my book. Better than somebody with no face at all. <laughs> Think about it. Wait, no so he's face. psychic? She's not like gonna that ignore said, him? I know what you're thinking. If there's an axe murderer around, that's him. No, he knows what you're thinking. That's You have it backwards, lady. So we're supposed to go in that elevator. This is where we came in from, right? So we've already been up here. Remedy is based in Finland. Is that the name of the dev team? <clears throat> the cell and the poster. I was 11 years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Starring Courtney Hope. I wasn't sure if we were, like, if I was supposed to realize that I looped back or if that was just actually something weird that happened. This is like me playing a new game for the first time. I legitimately was just like, oh, I guess I didn't notice. <laughs> I guess I didn't notice we Oh. See, once again, I, I assumed that there was an elevator there and I just forgot. That's usually my go-to, is to assume I missed something. Hey, Luis, what's up? 
Did you know this story is by Sam Lake? Control. The movie. The game. Did I lose you there for a moment? You know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. Seventeen years since the men of this bureau took him. Oh, geez. Oh, man, I could go for some hot and spicy peanuts. Pistachios right about now. That just says fibers. Do you think he'll credit himself as Sam Ocean and Alan Wake too? Please tell me that Alan Wake was originally going to be called Alan Lake, and then they were like, no, that's too on the nose, so they changed the name. That's gonna be my... my day theory. Approved terminology reminder. While pending any notifications of death related to the Willow Awe, please adhere to the following guidelines, words or phrases to use. In the service of his or her country, regret, proud pride will be remembered. Phrases to avoid. Alaska, scissors, blood, bleed, loss, apologies, sorry. Okay. Is the joke that the, the Federal Bureau of Control is just very... Okay, that pot just fell down. Oh, jeez. Um, what are they gonna say? They're very controlling, is what I was going to say. Feel that stuff go. Oh my goodness, this game's already falling apart. Internal lockdown in effect. Uh oh. There's Judge Billy. Barbara, I am not to be disturbed. Cancel all my appointments for the day. For the rest of the week, I can't trust them, Barbara. Not a single one, Trench. Okay. Uh, yeah, there is a lot of uh, portraits of uh, Judge Billy Trench around. <laughs> Everything's falling apart in this place. Goodness gracious, is this supposed to happen? Oh, there he is. Shit. He's dead? Shit, shit, shit. Uh... You want me to pick it up? The murder weapon? Really? Well, hang on, we don't know if it was a murder. Might have been a... Something's outside. Reverse murder. Oh, was coming here a mistake? It's so bright outside. Maybe he's okay. Maybe he's gonna make it. Wow, you would not be able to understand that. And there goes the poster. That was a weird looking Objects gun. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. Oh, look at the 
this place? Uh... Where am I? Were you supposed to be able to understand that without subtitles? Because there's no way... There's no way that would have been possible for me. Oh, there we go. Uh oh, how do I shoot? Oh, there's melee. Holy crap, that's melee? Alright, I guess we gotta get. That could be a friend, we don't know. Oh. It dropped some blue. The same gun. Hold the gun house. Okay. Now I have a gun. Uh huh. Service weapon. Yeah, I wouldn't even have realized that was a voice talking if those subtitles weren't on. I would have assumed it was like this noise. I thought I was supposed to jump down there. It regenerates ammunition automatically. Oh, the board is always subtitled, okay. Oh, jeez. Shots don't really do more damage. Uh, you could voice act multiple choice. Congratulations, Director. Did we win? Something hey, Sleepy. This threat. An attack. Duty as Director. Keep the Bureau safe. Did you hear that? It's the dead man. Right after the pyramid spoke to me, and it was just noise, and I understood every word. And this gun's alive. You know what? I'm happy. I'm happy to be here. So the janitor is the most powerful character? Things have quieted down outside. Is it safe to go? This map doesn't seem too bad. Uh -oh. Could be friends, we don't want to assume. You can't let this happen. You can't let this happen. You can't let this happen. Uh, <laughs> live action. You can't let this happen. You stopped it. <laughs> you... Oh, thank you. That was... Horror. 
Yeah, but they're still there. Hiss guard. Bro as many internal security personnel. The Hiss was quick to take advantage of this fact. Hiss guards use a standard issue bullpup rifles. They have no observed paranatural abilities. The exception, the Hiss guards are protected by shielding a dense Hiss resonance, capable of stopping bullets. Uh, does the Hiss mature in organic hosts over time or data is needed? Ammo efficiency. Okay. Ammo cost per shot, minus 60%. Or we could deconstruct it for triangles, but I don't know what that is yet, so I think we'll just ignore it. Check the director's office sign. Office of the director, Zachariah Trench. Was it supposed to change? The dead man. Okay. Director's portraits. Uh, I mean, I don't remember where all of them were. To be honest, I don't. I don't think there was one in the bathroom. us now now we're the director we're the captain now Shelter? For Marshall's eyes only. Marshall, we checked out the suspected AWE in Duluth. Wasn't anything, just like the house fire before this and the malfunctioning clothes dryer before that. My team's getting pretty sick of duds. We need to find a better way to sort the fake Oz from the real thing. Or you need to rotate these field agents off for a bit. Anyway, we're en route to Sherman Ranch, next one on the list. Let's hope it's a little livelier there. Uh, there. Sincerely, Special Agent Keenum. Uh. What the? Uh, 
I don't have any open slots. I need to upgrade, but how do I upgrade? safe in here. I haven't unlocked any checkpoints yet. We're lucky the game hasn't crashed yet. Rising cost of all response, update on mold eradication efforts, new supplier of coffee filters to be found and vetted. They really value their coffee here, don't they? Hmm. Checkpoint, checkpoint. Reminder, if you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. 1. Search the room for any altered items or objects of power. 2. Carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. 3. Wait for bureau staff to find you and the object. If there are no altered items or objects of power in the vicinity, then, reach your supervisor via the nearest intercom and await further instructions. Thank you for your attention. Hmm. If you experience an unanticipated building shift, follow these simple steps. One. Search the room for any altered item or objects of power. Two, carry the altered item or object of power to the nearest safe room. Three, you are a person stuck. Hissing sound that tried to evade Central me executive. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss your enemy? All right, it's our enemy. That babble's contagious. It burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over. Urban legends are believed to affect the creation of altered materials, but can also dictate the characteristics of an altered world event. Urban legends are understood as modern evolution of Jung's archetypes. We recognize certain blank informed by our own blanks. Popularized by our media, we have additionally proven that urban legends can be, even be artificially blank in popular culture using blank. Our bureau made anthology television program. The Night Falls? Uh, once the seeds are sown, human imagination exacerbates the details. Certain paranatural phenomena can clear elements of popularized folk folklores. Odds that only occur on blank, a pair of scissors that consume human blank through two punctures. Is this game just basically SCP the game? This whole time? That's what it was. I thought it was just you shoot stuff and you have telekinesis. Uh, these details living in the minds of so many have been given strength to believe. Urban legends are not just stories for children, they are paranatural realities waiting to happen. Refer to big file for big results. Established in 1964 as part of an effort to strengthen government relations, we're proud to serve the United States and her people as we strive for transparency and excellence in all aspects of our esteemed nation's infrastructure. So right after JFK was killed, basically. 
They do not leave, then ask them these questions. Are you here to see someone? Are you from New York City or just visiting? How'd you find this place? If their answers are sufficiently harmless, explain that this is a secure federal office and they'll need to leave. Their answers seem blank. Escort them to a private room. There, perform the gunner's psychological assessment. If the responses are within the acceptable range of deviance, see the provided scoring sheet, then blank immediately. Remember, there's no such thing as too suspicious. Oh yeah, I know. I noticed that the help. Wow, she truly is the full metal alchemist. So I guess not. I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. We don't know if yeah, they're I'm sane Pope. yet. I'm Emily Pope, a Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. Oh, shit. You're the new director. Hold on. We're coming out. Why should we have lied? should be proud of what our janitor has done. Oh, it's that that safe room we were in earlier. Director Faden. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. He's smiling a little too hard. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. Like the sound of poison gas. Okay. Leaking. We're in full lockdown. It seems to she have spread ADHD, everywhere clearly. and everyone not protected by an HRA. And extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. Trench is dead. Shot. By ah, this gun. But I, I didn't do it. <laughs> and the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can Oh, you love this crazy. game, Celeste? My first time he playing. He keeps appearing to me. Saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point. Push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. Wait, you did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. 
A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... The janitor made me director, <laughs> Look, in fact. Jesse, I have a million questions, and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I've she has such a, me for so long. A tick with like moving her her but I can't trust mouth her around and stuff. Or rather the bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking for you, of course. We can try it together. Okay. You with me? We did it before. Push the hiss out. See ya, suckers. Ha ha ha. Now I'm the safe one. You'll all be infected. Uh, harmonization devices. Yada yada. I thought she was about to punch her. <laughs> Did it. Oh, well, it goes. It didn't work. The hiss has burrowed too deep. They should Ripping be called the helium out, since it makes everyone heart. float. A balloon. Jesse, over here. We need to make a plan, Jesse. Yes. I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown ordinary 17 years ago her hometown's name is ordinary and covered the whole thing up i've been looking for this place for a long time that's enough maybe that's too much already i can't tell her about dylan and the rest yet i've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with ordinary you were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us. A few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench. The ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. The hotline It's Miami. another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Where is the hotline? I like how they just... It's kept in the communications department through the mailroom. It's all, part of the sector so we can all access this it so even normally. with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. Oh yes, all our employees are being they call infected. Me the director. 
Becoming evil balloons. That's not me. I'm not a director. You're the new director. I'm not a the old director's dead, but you can talk to him through a walkie-talkie. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. I think you are now. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. Okay. Go on. I know this is all new to you, so don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. The door to the comms department is just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open by now. Oh. House memory. Oh, these are materials? Game has crafting in it. Seems like we found a checkpoint, but we're still not able to upgrade yet. I'm guessing. There it is again. Our welcome message. Should have given us a parents card. The dress kind of funny. Oh, what the heck? I thought that was just someone outside. Go ahead. Should definitely break all the rules. Uh, let's see here. Visited the following Nevada accommodations Desert Sun Inn, Big Sky Motel, Starlight Motel, In and Out, In and Out, uh, Aztec Court, Sleep E Bear Motel, Silver Spurs Ranch, El Gato Blanco Inn. A plus lodge, a white cat, uh, mini bar, $300. I do wonder if a motel called the Ocean View is going to be found in a landlocked state, but hey, I guess it's not paid to think. I'm not paid to think, right? For the record, I again request that you give us the budget to get two rooms each night. Agent Riley and myself are very tired of sleeping in the same room. See you on the road, Agent L. Hines. The boys in research said performing rituals may help identify any places of power. Drinking those little whiskeys is my ritual. Would that be cool to have a job where they just pay for your traveling? 
Is that a stapler or an altered item? It's not. Not started again. Your option to turn off motion blur. Uh. I think it's one of those red times where the aiming is actually a little bit slower than I might prefer. Hopefully the game has it a little fast. I could turn that up a little. Oh, whoops, I actually meant. This barrier. They keep mentioning the hiss have these barriers, but I haven't really seen it fit. like the chapters gene god i had a dream and i built the thing i saw in my dream a machine that will contain god but not the god you know or the ones anyone knows new god this machine will be his body his heart and his mind i made it just like the dream showed me i used the motor from the refrigerator and the coils from my toaster and the fans plus the timing belt for my car's engine and the wheels for my son's skateboard God can't move yet, but the dream said he would learn how on his own. This is just a beginner's body, like a baby's, but a machine instead. God only needs a place to start. If you want to interview me, please contact me at the address on the envelope. My phone does not work anymore. I had to use the dialogue plate on God. That sounds pretty chill. Oh, so this department is called Dead Letters, and that was like the first dead letter we found. was protecting them. Does someone just throw a grenade? Both their friend. Oh, a new checkpoint. Yeah. 
Yeah, it did seem like the melee attack broke it pretty quickly. Havana summary was an upgrade? Uh, headshot damage. Exclusive to spin, grip, shatter, pierce. I don't know what that means, but... Sure, let's try that, why not? I usually try to go for headshots anyway. We even have energy? I feel like we don't we haven't been Oh no. It's just not good in there. I stepped around that stuff on the ground. The names of different forms for the service weapon. Gosh, I broke the toilet. Monster. 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 Please be aware, due to recent fluctuations on the nearest control point, the area stability has been downgraded to yellow. Reference for it. Green is stable, yellow is low possibility of unanticipated building shifts. Orange is high likelihood of unanticipated building shifts. Red is frequent unanticipated building shifts. I thought the building shifting was just a natural part of the place, like... Like, uh... I don't know, I guess it's supposed to. Oh, there's another one. Oh, I think that's the same one, it just closed by itself. I could I specifically remember leaving it open. I thought I might want to come back to that later. Like a slightly better health recovery. Maybe I should uh, use that.
Okay, so this has to be a different one then, right? Because I didn't close, like I know for sure I didn't close it. It's like a... Okay, that sure looks like the same one again. Once again, I am leaving without... Yep, it closed by itself, see? Not me. Yeah, I didn't close it. How dare you gaslight me. Finally, what the heck? What took you guys so long to exist? That's possible, but I, in, I specifically left it open on purpose, so it would be weird if I closed it, since I wanted to leave it open. That way I could keep track of which ones I've been in already. That's why when I went, that's why when I kept coming back, I opened it. Go. Oh, well. I left that one open so I would remember that I've already opened it. Luis said I really enjoyed this game. I'm enjoying it too, although I'm kind of lost right now. Like those demons showed up for a second. I'm, uh, I'm not sure. Go back to dead letters and head through to the communication department. Did I leave dead letters? I, didn't, I thought I was still in there. Not this way. I've, I've just been looking for signs. <laughs> That's the thing. I was looking for those green lights that usually show you where to go. Introduction Just to paranormal topic. Eight inches wide and capable of storing a whopping 80 kilobytes. <laughs> Stolen by our friends at the CIA, the disk held the launch codes to Soviet nukes. Uh, this is not the disk, of course, but one exactly like it. A perfect fusion of concepts vibrating in the Cold War era collective unconscious. A receptacle. It is a receptacle for dangerous energies to hone in on. And they did. We don't have the details, but when things started flying around the disk, it was transferred to us. It's an object of power. Oh, OP. Oops. Oh, and it can launch things telekinetically it's through OP. the air. Uh, to date, we, we've launched maybe three dozen pencils. That's Alan Wake's and voice actor. We even launched a cup. sure has a lot of bathroom. Unlike the Resident Evil mansion, which has one bathroom. <laughs> I 
Internet usage rules. I thought you couldn't have smart objects. Internet is not for social media use. No FPC materials of any kind may be scanned or uploaded. FPC email addresses are for work-related correspondence only. Level 5 clearance required to access the internet. The cubicle's black rock shell gets damaged, but vacated immediately and alert Mr. Thomas, or Tomasi. If you notice any text in your work that you do not recall writing, vacate your cubicle immediately and alert Mr. Tomasi. Do not connect internal comm devices to the network. Printers for communications department use only. Altered items are forbidden in the cubicles. Notify security of any breaches immediately. They may require eternal lockdown. <laughs> Zombies probably don't need to go to the bathroom that often. Hey, Luigi's Mansion had multiple bathrooms. They knew what they were doing. Oh! Like I started getting up and then the canister like bonked him in the head. You see that? It's a good one. I gotta see the replay of that on my own video stream. Oh my gosh, my video playback is so far behind. Fix that. And you have to do the uh the the fast forward technique on my own playback. That hurt. That way. An object of power. Something hits the right shoulder. We need to cleanse it. It's that floppy disk he was talking about. The floppy disk slash new. He didn't launch telekinesis. He just to believe It's doctor. harder to hear you when I'm here. It's like the channel's been changed. The board's in charge here. Their pyramids in the bureau seal. Are they really the ones pulling the strings? I'm not. Their <laughs> was that director. was that not how you're supposed I'm to get no up there? Director. It was literally a ladder. R1. Ooh, there we go. See, this is what I knew about the game. I knew you could do this. Holy crap. I didn't I honestly didn't even know it had all this crazy like otherworldly stuff going on paranormal activity all, all i knew is telekinesis i thought you were just in a building with telekinesis <laughs> <laughs> got stuck in the goop but i guess that activated this but he did call it op so i guess that you grab pretty far away objects too. Uh, only certain objects though. Even though they look the same as other objects. Let's get here. I got her shoot.
I feel like, I do feel like when you're aiming with the telekinesis, it's a little sensitive, which makes me wonder maybe that's why the sensitivity was down a bit for the gun. But I'm just gonna have to get that. The antagonist. There you are. You were gone. Cut off. I got it. Just like you wanted, right? This will help me fight the hiss. I don't see how else you could have gotten up here, honestly. I think you had to use that ladder. Uh oh, there's a guy up there. Oh, there's a few people around here. Oh, so this counts as regular sensitivity? And the gun is aiming sensitivity? Caught on fire. Well, now we can clear this area, I assume. Oh, I guess we don't have to. Someone showed up and cleared it for us. Emily said that the hotline can be reached through the mail room. Oh, okay, so the energy recovery is the telekinesis. So I haven't found a way to upgrade my stuff. Yeah, it does seem like it takes a while to reload your ammo. Six percent or anything. Energy recovery. Who's gonna drag us away?
Dude, calm down, my guy. Take a choke pill. Oh, this guy ability? Kind of surprising, I agree. Pay attention, Alberto. This is the last time I'm explaining this. Internal lockdowns are manually triggered events that lock one or all sectors by restricting use of the sector elevator, effectively locking staff in their sector until the emergency is handled. It can only be lifted via the directional override and maintenance once the director is satisfied, satisfied that the situation is under control. External lockdowns are a bigger deal, nothing in or out of the whole building. It's only triggered by a code red containment breach based on some complicated system that security and research slap together. It can only be lifted once A, the threat's been neutralized, and B, a high clearance individual gives the system the all clear. This process is not the same as the directional override, so stop saying so in documentation. I know it's confusing as hell, I've told Darling a hundred times to change it, but they're adamant and it stays the way it is. Honestly, I don't think they even know how to change it at this point. Let's just make sure our staff understand how the mess all works, okay, Marshall? They're just hanging out. They're just floating about. They're just deactivating their gout. I know purple rooms are bad. I want to stay away from that. You're listening to America Overnight, mystifying the airways for more than 29 years. Voices, another phantasmagorical phenomenon. It's like that radio Today, station my mom used to listen to late at night. His story. Quincy. Thanks. This is something I experienced recently while staying at the Chili Pines Motel in Macon for last year's Suspicion Con. I was in room 47. The night manager, an avid listener of the program, insisted I take this particular room. Now. The manager explained that years back, the body of a man was discovered under the bed, inside that wooden border that motel beds tend to have. And the body had been there a week, he said. Guests had stayed there, sleeping with the corpse a foot below him. They only found the body when housekeepers complained about the smell. Hauntings have been reported in room 47 ever since. I wow. happily took the room. I fell asleep pretty quick, checking under the bed first, of course. No of course. ghosts visited me. No chilly spots or flickering lights. But when I woke up, I found myself under the bed. <gasps> no. It was dark and stiflingly hot. Luckily, I was able to push the mattress off and crawl out before I suffocated. The night manager the miracle. was kind enough to find me another room. Oh, there you have it, listeners. What we call ghosts take many forms. Quincy was brave enough to tell his story, and I encourage I don't know how he was brave enough to tell that. That was like a you that was a traumatizing encounter. 
Maybe you're seeing colors that we have no name for. Maybe your toaster is possessed. Remember, dear listeners, when no one else believes you, we do. America Overnight, we'll be right back. Hey, look at us go. Look at that. It's one of my greatest gaming achievements right there. Look at that. She's like doing a split spin. It's got to be one of the best 360s in video games. Wait, look at this. Oh, clearance level one. About time. This reminds me of how they got Art Bell for the original Prey. Oh, is that what it was? Art Bell? Was it like Art Bell Coast to Coast or something? Let me check real quick. Because I haven't heard that in forever. Yeah, it was Art Bell Coast to Coast. My mom used to listen to that when she would go to work because she always worked like midnight shift. And he, he had a radio station that would come on super late and they would talk about like supernatural, paranormal things. Coast to coast AM. That's crazy. I hadn't thought about that in years. He's just chilling on an alien spaceship doing his show. Yeah. But that's cool, so he's in the original Prey, huh? Oh my gosh, is it like a, a chrome toilet? What is this, prog rock? Back everything in the future is chrome, don't you know? Interesting, in this spot, you can only fast travel, you can't change your clothes like that other spot. Another clearance level this one. Must open the door. Wait, how many clearance level ones do I need? Oh no, look at this guy. He ain't gonna be in control three. Places. Multiple keys, that's interesting. Ow. Don't do that again. Oh, you dodged it. Someone's on the floor now. We'll drop some stuff. I don't remember killing the other one. Oh. Wait, that's Tomasi? Isn't that the guy who's... Ow. The guy you're supposed to report to to use the internet. We're gonna unlock the internet after we defeat him. Yeah, but in most video games wouldn't wouldn't have multiple keys, which is interesting. They would just conveniently have one key on one body somewhere. He 
He's like a Superman cape. Protagonist of praise to Masi as well. I have a feeling he'll huh. be back. Yeah, I have a feeling too on it. Kind of his health part. The hotline should be past the, the mailroom. Oh, hotline chamber. There's a whole chamber just for the hotline. Pick out the rest of the first. Tell me to crouch to take cover behind low objects. How long has that been on the screen? Alberto Tomasi. Oh, it's his ID. I see Alberto issue twenty sixteen October or twenty nineteen. Well done, everyone. It was a strong campaign and perfectly executed, Alberto. Head of comms. Um, Prey 2006 is about a Cherokee man fighting aliens, not to be confused with Prey 2022 about a Comanche woman fighting aliens. The hiss got him. I think I might have got one of those for free off of uh, Epic, actually. I don't know which one it is, though. But summary. I know it's boot, but let's say but for fun. Uh, a spate of disappearances was traced to a home in the city of But, where bureau agents discovered a translocative light switch cord. But then, response: Bureau agents arrived at the home of local celebrity located at blank blank, which had been connected to a local total of blank disappearances in the area. Agents found no one inside. While searching a closet, an agent pulled the light switch cord and disappeared from view. Another agent was selected to pull the cord in order to rep replicate the event. He disappeared as well. Both agents were discovered at the oldest house blank days later, found in a sealed room by rangers exploring a new area of the house. The light switch cord in the butt home's closet disappeared during this incident. This literally reads like an SCP file. Like, it definitely has to have been an inspiration. All right, take this down. The situation in Cuba has been evaluated oh, by Prey the relevant is a movie. The mysterious illness affecting the staff at the U.S. Embassy in oh, you know what? caused by Sonic That's right. That was that was the alien prequel, power. right? Numerous personnel have damage to the inner ear, but most are expected to make a full recovery. Of course, the event also damaged their cellular walls, but we can't blame that on some stupid noise gun. <laughs> Thank God no local doctors examined them first. Honestly, with the odds at all tonight, Sorry, not uh, a predator. Yeah. Embassy. Talk about good luck, huh? <laughs> so much easier to... Hey, are you still recording this? <laughs> yeah, goofball. Oh, what's this? Although, since the two series are kind of intertwined at this point, I guess a Predator prequel would technically also be an Alien prequel. Find the hotline object of power. Oh wait, did I not find it? Alright, take this down. Oh, it's not that. The situation in Cuba has been evaluated by the relevant authorities. The mysterious illness affecting the staff at the U.S. Embassy in Havana is caused by sonic weaponry in the hands oh, of the hotline. Can't be far now. Very good. If you haven't seen it, one of the movies that lean, that is lean, but packs so much in every minute. Oh, those are good. That's how I felt about like uh. 
like the 11 Clover Street or whatever it's called. That was a really, really very tightly well done movie with a divisive ending, but I actually didn't mind the ending much myself. But aside from that, the movie itself was just really well paced for a, a short runtime. 10 Cloverfield Lane, there you go. 11 Cloverfield Lane will be the sequel. Hotline Chamber. According to their testimony, the agents had been transported from the butt home to a roadside motel named the Ocean View Motel and Casino. They discovered a room key by performing a ritual, see file MOT01. The key opened a door marked with an inverted black pyramid, which they only learned after a lengthy period of trial and error. After playing another motel card uh, cord found inside the room, they were transported to the oldest house. The disappearances of the home's owner and the other locals of Butt have, have been attributed to the light switch cord. The Ocean View Motel is now known to have many doors and pathways. Since the occurrence, identical light switch cords to the one found in Butt, the Butt home have begun disappearing throughout the oldest house. At the time of writing, blank light cords have been found in the oldest house located in the blank and the blank sectors. These all access the Ocean View Motel, though how exactly the link operates is blank. Unknown. <laughs> they had to delete that. But initial hypotheses center on the butt aw as a blank blank. See Dr. Daring's presentation. People were divided over the ending. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, yeah, some people did, did not like the ending, and I... I there's maybe like a bit of a dumbness in like the last few seconds of what a character kind of decides to do. It's a little silly, I would say, but I think most people just don't like the twist itself. And the twist, I was completely fine with. Like I, I went into the movie like not thinking any. I just went into it to take the movie as it was. I didn't even think of it. Uh, like what could be or what could happen and I just enjoyed myself uh, Hotline security log used very often by director Trench and the custodian Bill Everett and then at the end Carol Bishop I think I was only the director and the custodian using it like the entire time until the end I think people mainly didn't like that she turned into a badass at the end. Uh, I don't think she. The, well, that's that's to me. That's not. It, it's it's not that she's a badass. It's that it's silly that she would drive towards what she decided to drive towards. Because it's like. Because I think she does say something like, "Oh, I know how to defeat them" or something. But it's like. You just went through so much stuff right now. You you should get the hell out of it. Like at least take some time to recover. The light switch it was just a, for me. It was just a little silly, silly no how quickly more. she Black decided pyramid. to just drive right into that mess. Was the twist that the one character was telling the truth about what was going on outside? I took that as a given, considering the title of the movie. I think that's the problem fact. A lot of people assumed they were connected and because of that, the twist did nothing for them. But for me, I completely took their word for it that it was a completely new, unrelated thing. And I think that's why it worked better for me because I did not think of it as being, like I feel like, oh, like Cloverfield was just this, like a name of a thing, but it's going, like this one takes place in a different world or whatever. Um, yeah, I don't know. So that's how I took it for me. Cause, cause for me, a big part of the mystery of the movie is like, is he telling the truth? Is he not what's going on exactly? What's actually happening? And then it turned out like, spoiler alert, that he, it's kind of both. He kind of was right, but he also kind of wasn't. But de there was an apocalyptic situation going on. That much was true. Oh, what's that over there? 
Oh, it's that one room we saw in that cutscene. The Dreamcast logo. I've stayed at a lot of roadside motels. I gotta go into the, the Dreamcast country, room. Road, on the run, under the radar. This feels like all of them, like something recognized from a dream. Um. Oh yeah, they like the the Cloverfield paradox like shadow dropped. And then, and then me and, and Banana decided to watch it. Like, it just came out. And we were like, oh, sure, let's watch it. I mean, I, I don't think it was terrible in the terms of it was entertaining, but it was it was like a dumb movie. Like, the, Clo the Paradox... Clover Paradox was definitely the dumbest of them all. But I thought it was, like, funny. It was fun in the terms of, like, well, this is, like, just, like, a bad horror movie at this point. Uh... Um, what was I gonna say? It might be completely unconnected. It's, it's hard to say. It feels like you're supposed to take that one less seriously. At least that's how I took it. But I, I would say 10 Cloverfield Lane is probably the best out of them all. Because Cloverfield's like a fun movie as well, the original, but it's also kind of gimmicky in a way that it's like, yeah, it's it's found footage movie, which doesn't automatically mean it's not gonna be bad, but Hello? it does kind of here? suffer from some of the same problems as a lot of found footage movies. I think Cloverfield Paradox is actually supposed to tell you how the monsters got there in the first place. At the end of the movie, it's kind of showing you this is how these creatures kind of just popped in from another dimension because of what was going on in space on the ship or whatever. I think. It's been a while since I've seen it and I've only seen it the one time. The game still wants me to crouch to take cover behind low objects. Uh. Where am I going here? Oh, I'm doing a puzzle? Oh, okay. Maybe I need to turn the light on. Oh, hang on. Oh, no. She just slapped the handle, hang on. She did not try to turn that, she just smacked the top of it. America, Pacific Northwest Wonderland. New York, United Airlines. That's not in the Pacific Northwest. Why would they have posters for both of us? Miami, New York. That's weird that this hotel would have posters for like different parts of the US rather than where you currently are located. Was this door open the whole time and I just didn't notice it? Coffee me. Hotel bed. Where is this currently located? I don't know, we like teleported here. Oh, New York, right? That's where the building, right? That's where uh, the control bureau takes place, right? 
Wait, why did we teleport that time? Before we... Am I supposed to just jump in this room? Oh, I guess not. The Ocean View Motel. Oh, that's the Ocean View Motel. That was in Nevada, right? Because they were saying how's there an Ocean View, but it's in locked. It's a locked land state, and they, I think they said it was in Nevada. Oh man, where the heck am I? Where was that at, uh, even? Oh, it was up in the phone hotline, wasn't it? What? I gotta fight- Okay, I thought it was the boss all over again. That would have been kind of mean to make us redo that all over again, just because I fell into that room, which I didn't know how it was going to work. What the hell was that? A freaking rocket launcher? Where did that even come from? Hello? What is happening right now? I don't know what this dude with a rocket launcher. I mean, this might as well be the boss fight all over again. They're making us fight all these guys again. Like, I don't remember these guys with, like, freaking rockets and stuff. Gosh darn it. Get up to... Okay. Yeah, there was not dudes with rockets in here before. What the heck this is all about? Cool. No, this is like worse than if they just made me fight the boss again. What the hell's going on? No, literally, how dare they introduce new enemy types when I just died in a part that I was stuck at and now I'd want to get back to that part. This is, that's the worst possible time to suddenly have a bunch of new enemies. the heck? Actually, I thought that this was the room where the hotline was, was it not? Here it is. I'm worried about getting lost, about even finding the place again. Now you said read this sign right here? I cannot read this. 
stand here. Oh, that sign. Ocean View Motel and Casino Entry Point. The law of three applies. Ritual attunement required. Agent must orient and anchor motel to their personal. You just press it. Okay, so you hit it multiple times. No. I've stayed at a lot of roadside motels. So it said the rule the country, of three, so you road, press, you you pull it three run times. Run under the radar. This feels like. So you hit this three all times. Of them, like Which is funny because I thought I did hit it three dream. times. They tell your remake to stop being so damn greedy with its small scrap. I can't help you, that that game gets greedy sometimes. The key has a black pyramid on it. Did I pick up a key last time? I feel like because I was talking about movies, like, I don't remember I did that. Oh, there's a black pyramid. An upside down black pyramid. In fact, I wouldn't even call it a pyramid, I would just say upside down triangle. Oh. So we've closed the gap now. Man, that, that's kind of a weird because because that sign is very easy to miss because you don't even notice you can read it originally and then once you're in that room you're not near that sign anymore so you could completely miss that hint I did open that room, Fack. You don't remember when I went in there and I was and I was walking around and I was like, oh I don't remember this room being open. Like you're 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 mi you're missing a lot of stuff today. Are you are you feeling okay? Cause you remember you thought I shut the safe when I didn't. You thought I didn't have that room open when I did. No, I literally did. I remember walking in the room and I I was trying to turn on the radio actually. Oh, there's more than one room you could go into, but they all look the same. But only one of them has the key in it. Okay, now the game's glitching. I knew this was gonna happen. Once it turns time, okay, well. They fell into a hole. Okay. Once it turns tiny, maybe then. Oh, I thought it just resets you whenever you mess up in the these areas. We're there, we have to reload it again. I'm guessing we just want to avoid those.
phone's still ringing. That was weird. Okay, I gotta take care of Waltz real quick and I'll be back and then we'll, uh, we'll finally pick up the phone. We'll finally cease the ringing. Imagine if the ringing kept going while I was paused and you had to wait. You had to just listen to the ringing the whole time. That would be pretty messed up. Ask me.
video games are back on the menu, boys. It is a phone. It's an object of power. It doesn't connect to any typical network. A direct line to the astral plane and the board. And my hypothesis is, under the right conditions to other planes of existence as well. A director needs a team, my management team. These people know the secrets of the Bureau as well as I do. Some even better. Darling, Tomasi, Salvador, Marshall. Marshall especially, my head of operations. She sees right through me. She knows I don't like relying on people. The only person you should fail is yourself. But things change when you become director. Oh boy. I'm the sheriff. Uh oh. Got that I bloody have it. nose. The hotline. I can reach Trench. Well, listen to him. He feels more like an echo. An echo with important info. I need to get back to Emily. People react strongly when I tell them about you. Is it too soon to tell Emily? She might be able to help. Hello, Jay. Review one game. One game? Oh, isn't this where we found him dead the first time? What's up with that? Game just can't keep its story straight. Darn it. I don't know what I just picked up. Polar bear attack on an Alaskan town. I don't like to boast, but claiming that the family was killed by migrating polar bears desperate for food because their ecosystem was being ruined by global warming was a stroke of genius. Level four clearance. What the heck has that? around this maybe in here Jesse did you get the hotline I mean how is it out there the comms the hiss I got the hotline I could make out what Trench is saying now incredible what did he say he talked about his management team people who knew the Bureau of Secrets your boss darling Tomasi but he's gone and he's gone Salvador He's the head of security. And Marshall? Helen Marshall is head of operations. She's tough, ex-CIA. She took her rangers and went to the research sector to secure the HRA production. She hasn't come back. Those weird, like, Ghostbuster traps they're us. all wearing as, like, The other the sectors. How do I get there? It's impossible because of the internal lockdown. You can perform a directorial override to lift it, but that can only be done in the maintenance sector. Normally, you take the sector elevator down there. It connects all the sectors, but it won't work while the lockdown is in effect. 
We already got past one lockdown. Maybe I can find a way. Jesse, look, with no prep, no training, in this extreme situation, you are doing phenomenally well. And all that and the hiss can't seem to affect you. I mean, I would love to run some tests on you. If you agree, that is. We could find out something that would help us. Tests? I don't know. She might find out about you. But I wouldn't mind understanding more myself. Okay. If you think it will help. Great. I'll check the internal documentation for any lockdown bypasses. I don't think we you need can to just get these grab random open people. To locate Darling and Marshall. And I'll look for a way inside the maintenance sector. The sooner we find one, the sooner I reach this override. You watch this stream while you go to sleep. Hey, that works. You can you can make it a sleepy stream. seen that guy in a while. Upgrade and unlock new abilities from the newest control point. Do you hear that? Someone's singing. Singing? Oh. Wants us to get a Sounds field like field it's field coming from the elevator. Like what? We can't get any equipment from the research sector until the internal lockdown is lifted. And see what you can find around here. Astral constructs, board any measuring device. Okay, so this costs one recycling symbol. I have four. Should probably just do one to each. Got a milestone reward, additional weapon form slot. Next one. Not enough essence to reset a build. Six thousand of those. as you can find. Help you. Shatter has high stopping power with a shatter scatter shot that devastates grouped enemies at close. So this is like a, a special move for your gun. And I have enough to construct it. Secured weapon mod con a random oh, I don't have any threshold remnant I wonder if I should get this construct shatter upgrade
There should be a mod for this game that makes you Gorilla Grodd. I'm gonna wait. It's a surefire way to get on Darling's good side. Executive incursion hiss guards. Oh, now there's like little challenges. Hmm. Search for your way to into the maintenance sector. Hope has asked us to document the his incantation. the maintenance sector even is. Why is this so Rector's off it. Apparently Grodd is connected to the speed force in some way. Yeah, he invented it. I mean, I think, believe he taps into the speed force in, uh, at one point. Listen, I know you can't control building shifts, but the executive level restroom has been missing for weeks now. I worked my ass off in the Islamabad station for three years. I've earned the right to a nice workplace shitter. If you can't bring it back, at least find out where it went. Sorry. Projectile chip. I thought I'm already using. Exclusive to Shatter. I need a sorry fact, but I need to look at the map. I, I don't know where the maintenance sector is. It actually doesn't say on the map either. If I talk to her again, she'll know. are eradicating the oldest house. The hiss are tampering. Hi, Jesse. Thanks. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions. Jukebox 
Mr. Elevator. Maybe the elevator. To work. Meet me in the main denounce. There we go. Like I said before, the janitor is a friendly face. Janitor Grodd, his pony Walkman. Beware of named enemies, they're more resilient to damage, tend to have more armor, and their attacks can be. And they're immune to your telekinesis throw, apparently. The maintenance sector is the janitor domain. If I can find Ati here, he can help me reach the override. Maybe it was you who got me into the oldest house with the lockdown on. Maybe it was Ati. It felt like he made the elevator appear that took me to Trench's office. Is Ati guiding me too? Directorial override is right there, in the control room. How do we get there? I didn't have tried doing gotcha in Resident Evil 4. I had the same thing, it kept giving me gotchas for things I don't use. It was like, here's extra TMP ammo. Oh, thanks. Here's more bolt ammo. Oh, cool. Oh, what the hell? Appear out of nowhere. I mean, ah. Those guys appeared out of nowhere. They just like materialized in midair. Not midair and out of thin air, I should say. Didn't you get the jailbreaker charm immediately into your hardcore run? I don't remember what the jailbreaker one does, it doesn't sound familiar. But I did get the the Dipman glitch, the glitch uh, gun arm during my hardcore run. That was probably like the best one I got. That's the one. I don't, I don't, I don't, the director it wasn't, it wasn't a gel right breaker, it the was the striker. How do we get there? Because that's what you have to use to do the dip man glitch. It's specifically that gun. Yeah, I don't I don't know the Resident Evil 5 names for the guns.
The only gun I know is the Killer 7. Hello, Double O. Uh, I think you could switch with shoulder. I forget what Gwen does it though. I could have sworn I put it up. There it is. You know what I need to do? I need to be uh, grabbing objects. I forgot that was a thing. Yeah, the loading screen is kind of long. The directorial That's override true. is right there in the control room. How do we get there? Okay, what exploded? I don't even understand why that just happened. Oh, they have grenades, but I did not see a grenade. I, was, I thought I just threw another metal box. I didn't see a generator. Any, anything that looked like a generator, I mean. people to show up again. Black Rock Quarry? Why is there a quarry in this place? Red Flintstone gonna be down there? Fred, please, you've lost your mind. Fred, your family's worried about you, Fred. All you do is say yabba dabba do all day. I can stop anytime I want. In oh, it's more like items. Did I 
they coming from this way or that way? Mission, what? Oh, I activated. Let's get the strange light and the break. Something strange about. Okay. Pardon me? Lens the merry go round horse object of power. Oh, this place makes me nauseous. I don't know why it looks the same as those other places. An object of power. How do you think it got down here? Uh, magic. A carousel horse. Why is kid stuff always so creepy? If she was in the Matrix, she could probably stop bullets. She was the chosen one. I think she is a chosen one, though, actually. Now that you mention. Circle to evade? What am I evading? Oh, that's a new ability. They just refer to the horse as a choo-choo. It's more like a dash, I would call it. Oh. Like, I'm sure you could use it to evade, but... Please, oh gosh, what killed? Gold enemies are immune to my attacks. Oh, that's easy. I just have to. I like can knock it off. Just truly invincible. It doesn't take up too much energy. <laughs> We're bound with Let's the horse. Keep up with me now. And we got two ability points. <laughs> Hard to see right here. Drawing the pyramid. The what? The pyramid. The pyramid. The one pyramid. What's a pyramid? The black pyramid. It's in the astral plane. Airplane? Astral plane. It's big, white, and empty. Or is it? It's a weird, crazy, alien dimension. The white goes on forever. You can get lost in all that white and never find your way back home. I miss my home.
Okay. Let's see. Suddenly, it's all so clear. Is that his room? The door, the door with his own picture on it. Well done. You got the job. It's place for congratulations. Yippee, Sadrana. It happened in the last drop. I truly need an assistant. Funny thing is, I've been a janitor. I'm more at home in that role than as the director. Only Ati here seems to see that. Yeah, hi, Ati. Look, we need to get the lockdown lifted, otherwise I can't get to the other sectors. Can you help me get to the override? Yes, yes. Easy peasy. It's just around the corner. But first, we need to get you working. Very small couple of hours jump. Something tells me it's going to be more than that. Yeah, you think there's a dog buried in this? I can tell you are not the yesterday's Krause's son. That's why right. you're made a great assistant. Very well. I'll hit the facts on the table. Mä Magnus mun perkele suoraan, että this house has a vermin problem. A bad one. They've already messed up the cooling pumps. And the uh, power generators of a power plant perkele. And the pensioner inside is starting to feel the pant around his head tighten. The situation needs to be fixed before the plant blows up. And we all disappear like a fart in Sahara. Trying my best to keep up with this. Fix the coolant pumps and the power generators, otherwise the power plant will blow. But don't what you power worry. Plant? I've left you clear instructions. You'll catch the end of the thread before I go to my vacation. The works on the task board here. You can do later, when you have time. Vacation? Right. Yes, no one's gonna cancel my holiday or seeds gonna rattle. But don't worry at all. He doesn't realize he can read her mind. And soon this crisis is gonna be last winter snow. You better go now, so you don't have to run with your head as your third leg. The door in the back leads to the plant. The door in the back. That's great. There is level Thank two. you, Ati. And none of these upgrades we were picking up came with. Okay, so what happens again if that thing blows up? Power. Explosion. Too much. Director's duty. Keep the lights on. Alright. 
North Moore was director before me. I never wanted his job. I never wanted power. I purposefully avoided it. Didn't trust it. Didn't want to rely on it. North Moore was all about power. A man like an explosion, hungry for authority. Hey, for Mike, order, I'm just playing for more control until it was too much. I had pretty to much just like Doom if you end, think about it. Contain the situation. Northmore never liked me, but he went along with it, to his credit. He didn't really have a choice. I suppose at the end of the day, a director's most basic duty is to keep the lights on. Here's to you, Northmore. There were no prime candidates waiting in the wings, but I was there. Had been the whole time, keeping my head down, working the my ass off. The man. I had nothing to lose. I picked up the gun almost on a dare. Oh yeah, I have a dash, I forgot. Escape. Oop. Uh, object of power escaped the Panopticon a couple of weeks ago. I want everyone to keep an eye for it. Merry go around. Oh, I already took care of that. This game thinks hard drive space is free. I think it was like a. F I don't know how much, how big this game was. Actually, probably pretty big. I had to delete some data off my PS4. Is that Emma Stone? Uh, it's her... It's her cousin. Emma Brock. Emmy... Emmy Jemmy. Other oh, shelter. Look at this fancy chrome toilet. What more do you need? Ma'am! Hey! Hello. Chief Arish, FBC Security. Shouldn't you be in a safe room? They Hello. all have HRAs. We're on the same side. My name is Jesse Faden. I'm here to perform the directorial override to get the lockdown lifted. Yeah, yeah, Chief Arish, FBC Security. I'm just... Oh, hang on, you're the new director. <laughs> um, it's a pleasure, ma'am. Let's skip the formalities, please. Right. Faden, ma'am. Look, Let's as go, you can okay. probably tell, uh, it's a bit of a shit show down here. We've been holding our ground, but whatever's gotten into our buddies has them wrecking the coolant pumps and the power converters. The NSC keeps overheating, and my crews keep getting shot before they have a chance to make any repairs. NSC? Oh, sorry. Bureau jargon. It's what we call the power plant. You know, the uh, big rumbling metal thing? <laughs> uh, Salvador, head of security, asked me to protect it in case of an attack. See, what's inside is dangerous. And Dr. Darling seemed to know it would be a target. Darling? He's here? No, he came down a few days ago, before everything went to hell. He was out of it. He smelled like a bar mat. He was ranting about vulnerability and how he only had one large-scale HRA, but that he needed it somewhere else. Still, at least he gave us these personal HRAs before he left. Hey, did I mention that he was tearing his clothes off? <laughs> Crazy dude. Darling knew the hiss was coming. Listen, I love playing 20 questions as much as the next guy, but we have got to get the water and electrical systems repaired before... Damn it, this is Half-Life 1 all, all over guys again. Doors out of here for I'll take care of it. I remember you had to you turn on the water and the electricity. The That's where I got lost when I played this? that the first time. That's what we're calling him? Oh, that's catchy. Oh, listen, the radios aren't working, so if you find my boss Salvador out there, could you please ask him what the plan is? I'm sure he will have one by now. I'll keep an eye out for him. 
He sure has a lot of faith in his boss. Try to stay alive. Nice. Oh, look at that. All right, let's see. We get some more health, energy. Launch. I have three and these cost three, so I feel like I should use it on one of these. Uh, more health is always good. Go wrong with it. Upgrade grip. Unlock the second mod slot and increase base. Then, then is a generous magazine high rate of fire. Oh dang. Mike licks for the for the three dollar donation. Tell me the fist bump. Thanks, I appreciate that. <laughs> that's a that's a silly uh little little animation is I could get this one, the shatter. You know what? Let's just get it. Screw it. I can't afford these ones anyways. All right. All about. Weird weapon mod. <laughs> Gobble said, wow, Mike's sucking up to the streamer. Look, Gobble, just because now that I like Mike more, because of the donation and he's going to get more attention. It doesn't mean that I don't treat everyone equally. Oh, I'm just kidding. Everyone is the same in my eyes. Unless they're evil. So these just, you make random mods, which I don't know if I want to do that. But hang on, what's this upgrade though? Okay, can't do that yet either. Whoops. So many games have like two separate pause screens now. It always throws me off. Okay. Alright, so if I'm on a weapon, like I'm on the shatter type, why would it show me the one that I can't use at all? It should just only be the ones that I can use. Alright, projectile fired, projectile spread. Ammo refund chance on hit. I don't see. Let's get this one. What am I using right now? 24% more health recovery pick on pickup. So this is just the worst version of the one I already have. Both of these are. I could just sell these. <laughs> Senpai noticed me. True. Uh, I'm just gonna leave the one I have on. I found that one in like a sneaky spot, and apparently it's still like the best one to have on at the moment. Yo, what the hell? Do I have like a shotgun now? Oh yeah, pretty much. Okay, that's cool. Where am I going? Oh, here we go. Holy crap, what is that? First time I'm seeing those. They explode, okay, that's cool. Oh, some more of them. Get out of here. Oh 
Oh no! Oh no! So many of them. Oh my god! Where are they coming from? This is ridiculous. Ward. Oh, I'm glad I just upgraded to the shotgun. Okay. Guess that was explosive. Alright. Uh, replace the part. Replace the part? Ah, okay. Let's see. Imagine if you just had telekinesis all the time. These new enemy types are getting pretty crazy. Not gonna lie. Furnace chamber. That sounds cool. So bright. Yeah, I can see how this probably would have fried my computer if I tried playing this on PC. Ow. Oh, okay. This is it. My name is Dr. Pierce, lead researcher of the Power Kinesiology Department. I believe. I've discovered a code Omega paranatural entity Code Omega? within the Bureau itself. Wow. Right under our noses. Darling refused to allocate me the budget or reverse the film. I'm taking matters into my own hands. I need to The furnace can It's been talking to me for some time now. mail tube complaint hey bozer get this the accounting department still says they haven't received my expense reports they say the receipts probably got lost in the mail tubes because of a shift or threshold or some fucker <laughs> going on here Dude, this place is so unprofessional Pumps. I don't think I'm even supposed to be in the furnace area yet. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Cool. Oh. Okay. We're underground now. I don't like that sound.
is this? I hit someone apparently. Where does this need to go? Oops. Oh, okay. <laughs> There's one of them. Whoa, what the? Oh, that was a big monster just to do with the shield. These guys are house strong. Walter killed me. Anyone asks that was Walter's fault. Remember that. Oh, Bob. And the Loading the screen after you die is like so quiet. Eerie silence. Ah, oh, dang. All the way back here. I had to give Walter a treat to distract him. It's the best I can do. This place is gonna come down. Not if I can help it. Where are these guys at? Uh, okay. Oh, one of them goes right there. One of the generators. Oh, right here. It's a cake. Where's the other one?
Oh, right here. Yeah. Just here with blocking. My old enemy, the clock, is blocking the virus. My old enemy, the clock. Sounds like a super villain for a toilet man. The clog. A change of guns. Oh. Alright, what the hell's blocking this? Ow. I don't I don't I don't know where this thing's plugged up by. Right here, man? I believe I'm looking for a clog right now. Maybe I need to follow it this way. Oh no, I can't leave. a health bar now. Oh, that's my <laughs> God damn it. There's like one little spot left to hit. Damn, I hope I don't have to fight all those guys all over again. Water. Ah. Good. Bad. I'm gonna have to. 
and she walked her. What are you up to, Walter? I see that guilty look in your God damn it. Let's see. Maybe we're at least onto the clog again. I think we are actually. We need to fix this thing ASAP. Ah, that looks like that leads. I wonder. Oops. I've made a mistake. I think we just have to deal with the clogs. It oh, you can't shoot them, it just takes a lot of shots. Or precise shot. Is that the amazing Spider-Man's girlfriend? Uh, Emma Stone? Oh, he got splattered on by radioactive sewage waste. That's almost as good. Come on. That sucks. What was that? There's some kind of beginner's trap at all them? I don't really like when, when you're you're dying in a game and it changes the screen to get covered up with crap. And then it just makes it more likely for you to die because it's harder to see things. <sighs> Damn it. They're gonna make me run all the way back down here, aren't they? Control, but it's back in. No work to do. Ah, uh, they really did. They did me dirty again. I don't like that sound. At least they have multiple lines for when you're redoing a part so you don't hear the same line over and over again.
is that? Oh, that's the most disgusting thing I've ever seen. The secret to all of them. Oh Jesus! God damn it! They got me. Ah. Why does that do so much damage? Like immediately one attack and I'm in red again. I'm full health. They kind of remember the direction. boost I could use that right now shot. I think it actually got me out of the red so it applies to the health you already have this thing ASAP. I think I take care took care of the clock. Ah, there's another one right here. There the pipes. Nothing more satisfying than manual labor. It's funny, they had us dealing with the clog before they even had all the... CNSC energy converters. Okay. Cool. Do with a minigun, why not? <laughs> okay, that didn't work very well. Oh, his shield is not breaking. It's the first guy I've ran into where his shield didn't break from either a melee attack or 
telekinesis. Again. At least it saved the unclogging. I don't like that sound. His shield just does not come down. Dirty. There it goes. Oh good, he's dead. Oh no, he's not. He just dropped health for some reason. That's... What is up with this game? There we go. Please. Damn it. I missed whatever it was that it was going to show me there. If you don't hold it down the first time, you just go to it. Just pick up a fight. I don't know which one it could be. I forgot I had a dash. This would be the best spinning animation I've ever seen. Okay. Uh, enemies? Are you? In okay. They were pointing their guns away from me, so I wasn't sure. Is that a friend? of these guys right now.
Oh, great. Okay. Blow, blow them up. Don't blow me up. We do. Where the hell are all these guys coming from? They're all over the place. What's your read on all this? Uh, energy conversion's well below the acceptable percentage. Internal pressures, climate. Wait. One of the sectors asking about RT. Talk to you. Oh. When the converters and coolant pumps are working again, we should be able to get this baby back down to a safe temperature. I hope. Okay, so I still have to do the other thing. I should be going. Try to stay Price. alive. You gotta lock down the lift. All right, I'm gonna just save here and then. Cause it's the NSC pump. Oh, the energy converters are the other way. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm going to save here and then we'll continue. Um, uh, should, should we save? Return of the last checkpoint. Alright, that's going to be it for tonight. Thanks everyone for joining. Hope you have a good night.